Hello everyone, this is Joy. In this video, we are going to solve another interesting problem on matrices and determinants. So the problem is, the eigenvector E1 corresponding to the smallest eigenvalue of the matrix 2a square a0, a1 a, 0 a 2a square, where a is equals to square root of 3 over 2 is given in terms of its transpose by and these are the four options and you have to choose the correct answer from this. So if you want, you can pause this video and give it a try and then continue with this video. So to solve this problem, let us denote our given matrix by capital A. Now if you put the value of small a in this matrix that is a is equals to square root of 3 over 2, then a will become this matrix whose elements are 3 square root of 3 over 2 0, square root of 3 over 2 1 square root of 3 over 2. 0 square root of 3 over 2 and 3. Now if e1 is the eigenvector of the matrix A, then it should satisfy this equation that is A times e1 is equals to lambda times e1. Here lambda is the eigenvalue corresponding to the eigenvector e1 of the matrix A. Now we have to check for each eigenvector given in the options which satisfy this equation and for which lambda is minimum. So for option A, if you multiply the eigenvector with the matrix A, then you will get an eigenvector whose all elements are 0. Therefore, we can say that the eigenvector given in option A satisfies the equation A u1 is equals to lambda u1 where lambda is 0. So it is an eigenvector of the matrix A corresponding to the eigenvalue 0. Now let's check for the other options, whether the eigenvalue is negative or not. So for option B, if you multiply the vector with the matrix, then you will get 4 over 2 times the eigenvector. Or you can say that the eigenvector given in option B also satisfy the equation A times E1 is equals to lambda times E1, where lambda is 4. Now for option C, if you multiply the vector with the matrix, then you will get 3 times the given matrix in option C. Therefore, we can say that the vector given in option C is the eigenvector of the matrix A corresponding to the eigenvalue lambda equals to 3. Now, for our last option, option D, if you multiply the vector with the matrix A, then you will find that it is not an eigenvector of the matrix A as it does not satisfy the equation A E1 equals to lambda times E1. Therefore, we can say that the vector given in option A is the eigenvector of the given matrix corresponding to the smallest eigenvalue and the eigenvalue is lambda is equals to 0. So for more solved problem on matrices and determinants, please see the playlist. The link is in the description.